Well guys, this is pretty disgusting, like the view of the city, the concrete jungle, but let's make it better and different. And here we are guys, I guess this view is much more better than the previous one. guys welcome to another video jacob and gwen here together again and in this video we decided we want to go for an exploration of some waterfalls here in czech republic on a google map we were checking out those which are quite interesting something about and and then we found one so we just get into the car and rode there it was like almost two hours to get here and now it's about one hour of walk <laughs> to get to those waterfalls and I'm, hungry. I'm hungry and there's no stores there's no even fruits like in the Philippines there are no kainito, santo, lobi, manga mm. so you can guys see it surprisingly no stores in the middle of the forest just like in Bajan <laughs> like in but... the area. We did not came here for shopping, we came here for waterfalls. I hope we can also take a bath there and swim there if it's possible. So join us on this trip with us and enjoy the video. Okay guys, so shocking moment for me as a Filipina, Karon, uh, we are now walking under um, in the middle of the forest, so shocking Kai, they have a police station <laughs> and imagine this is in the middle of the forest and in the Philippines we don't even have like that and here in Europe even if in the forest they have a police station, crazy right? <laughs> Just to explain for you guys why I said in the beginning the disgusting view of the city both of us with Gwen currently live in the city but it's not really our favorite place actually there is nothing to do in the city for us some other people may be enjoying that staying and living in the city but it's not for us because we both actually came from the villages all our life we've been living in the villages and it's still better for us. I grew up in the little village. There is the river right in front of my house. When I came from province in the Philippines, which is like countryside in the middle of the forests. And there is Haro village. So that's why we always like to escape from the city to the nature. It's really much more enjoyable being surrounded with these than with the buildings but i still wonder if there are fruits here in your forest <laughs> no fruits <laughs> well i can steal something and the thing why we decided for waterfalls <coughs> it's pretty common to have waterfalls around every corner in the philippines People just taking a bath there in the summer and I would like to try as well. Actually, it's really not that hot today, but still if it will be possible, I would like to take a bath. We will see. Like we are just about the last couple of minutes to the waterfalls but Gwen decided it's very tiring walking and she needs to take some break so she just climbed up there and having her five minute break and then we are continue so the one thing about the Filipino culture Filipinos are not much into walking they don't like much walking and what I did I took Gwen for a five kilometer walk to the waterfalls 
it takes about one hour she's telling me it's like a torture for her <laughs> and as a reward that she will manage this hike I owe her a pizza I said okay but you have to count for me what's our current speed of walking if we have to walk five kilometers and it takes one hour so now she's counting her brain is burning so if it's five kilometers for one hour five minutes five minutes for five minutes in five meter <laughs> Well, no. it's a teacher of English and history. Not everyone is into mathematics. Mm -hmm. But this... <laughs> this is funny. <laughs> Let me know, guys, in the Maybe. comments what's the correct answer of our speed. After a couple of minutes of counting, Gwen got the answer. One meter per liter, which is obviously <laughs> wrong. It's been like 30 minutes of walking. We are still walking next to this little stream but still no waterfalls like this time we think we are close to the waterfalls i guess we will try to cross this little bridge and we will see when decided she wants to cross over the river and check the caves inside Gwen can always pick the best ways. So guys, you can see in the background the splashing of water. So we just arrived to those waterfalls. So enjoy the first look on that with us. So I'm really amazed how people can build those stairs for the tourists whenever we come here. So it's easier access for us knowing that there are so many falls and look how amazing the nature here is. It was really amazing idea that people build those wooden stairs so you can easily explore the, from the bottom of the waterfall to the top. We are still I guess here in the middle of the waterfall and we are still going that way. So let's see, so many people here as well, you, with dogs, with children, because of that so many waterfalls and the same areas around the water are so many in the Philippines. And Filipinos know how to walk. I cannot keep with Gwen, she's literally jumping over the stones. I have a little bit of hard time. You know that I'm small and I can fit anywhere. Yes. No, it's not rose. One slip and she's in the water. So guys, we are currently on the top of the waterfalls. No more cascades anymore. So we will return back to the bottom and we will find some spot there to take a bath. We will see what will happen then. Here is so many fallen trees over the water, but it looks amazing. It puts amazing atmosphere to this place. Like, it's really out of the touch of the human, only the stairs. We are done exploring all the waterfalls, we are back at the bottom of them. And now we will just take a quick bath here. 
we will get ready and we will go home. It was amazing experience today. The water is very refreshing, we feel very awake, we will just dry ourselves, we will change the clothes and we are ready to go. We just arrived home, as you can see, Gwen answered the question about the speed correctly, so she got her pizza, we will enjoy it later. And by this we would like to say hello, so thank you guys for watching, I hope you enjoyed this video. Stay tuned for the other videos and if you like this and our other content we will always appreciate likes, comments, subscription. So stay tuned and see you again in the next video.